The Education Policy and Analysis Program is a one-year master's program here at the Harvard Graduate School of Education that believes we can change the world through learning and education, specifically by engaging in the education policy process. That means understanding the issue and the context. That means being able to analyze educational policies and evaluate them. And it means being able to affect change through advocacy and um, understanding how education policies are implemented. The students in our program come to us with a variety of backgrounds. Many students come with a few years of work experience, sometimes directly in schools or districts, sometimes in some other part of the education sector. Other folks have many years of experience, but are maybe shifting from perhaps a direct teaching role into a role more in policy. And we also have many students who are coming directly from undergraduate. Those are all different ways that you can be successful in this program. and we really value having that variety of students in our program. So I believe you should come to the Education Policy and Analysis Program because of our amazing faculty and our commitment to teaching and learning and advising. We have a world-class faculty. They are doing research on exactly what you come to learn about in education policy, how we evaluate education policy, how we create and implement education policy, They've written the books. We've written the books on exactly these topics. Our quantitative courses here at HGSC are really, really special. I think it's really important for public policy professionals to be able to be facile with data because when you're working in the policy environment, you're not working directly with kids. You are working with kids aggregated up into data form. And so being able to use this data proficiently is a core skill that I think all policy professionals should have. Now, I know we have many students who come here who feel a little anxious about using data. Maybe they haven't had a great experience in the past. And I just want to assure you all that our faculty here are second to none at working with students who come in a little bit nervous and really building excellent skills that will serve you well when you go back to practice. The Education Policy and Analysis Program tries to instill um, five competencies. Uh, and these competencies include, for example, the integration of values and goals, which is to say, what problem are we trying to solve or what mission are we trying to advance? How to evaluate trade-offs as we design policies, how to evaluate evidence um, that helps us to determine whether existing policies or changes in policies are effective. Our students go on to so many really cool and exciting things after EPA. We have students who go on to roles that are very directly working in policy environments, whether it's state legislatures, state education agencies, federal level. We have folks who go on into districts in systems roles. Uh, we have people who work in nonprofits and foundations. Um, the roles they take on sometimes are program coordinator type roles where they're managing or running a program related to education. Sometimes they're analysts where they're doing more data work to support other people running programs. Sometimes they actually become policymakers. Um, but it's a really wide range of things that students do afterwards. And I think it's really cool. We believe that um, changing educational policy is one of the best ways to create lasting change in education. But the only way to do that well uh, is to be able to understand the issue and the context, to be able to analyze and evaluate policies, and to be able to engage in the policy process um, to create policies um, and understand how they should best be implemented.